Hey guys and girls, White Ninja here, back with some more State of the K. I would say I'd continue where I've left off, but I have not. I am so far, much farther, further, farther, further ahead. It's unreal. I've got a lead on something for you. Ooh, thank you very much. You'll find it on your map. Yeah, well, thank you for that as well. Um, so, yeah, for, I can't remember exactly what, what I actually had covered in the last game, but now I have quite a lot covered. Um... And I also need to go and get a new house. I also need to go and speak to her. Um, so yeah, so you can, we're actually in the process of um, changing like stuff. So you can get like real big upgrades and things. So I'll upgrade that first, which gives me more defense. I'll do that to get rid of any zombies. Um, and also uh, Marcus, the guy who was my main character, I got him killed by accident. Obviously, it was quite dramatic and quite amusing. Uh, God's sake, what's this? Right, yeah. Um, yeah, so basically what happened was I hit some random rock was originally in the middle of nowhere and, um, yeah. So it just exploded. And then a zombie came and kicked the shit out of me. What the f... Seriously, mate? Yeah, so unfortunately, now I've got to use this loser. Um, like, Marcus was by far my best, uh... Oh shit. Oh, that's not good. That is not good. Uh, yeah, so if you look at the mini map, you actually get like super zombies now. Um, and you can tell which ones they are by the dot being slightly bigger um, than your usual one. That's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, so your dot being slightly bigger than your usual. Um, and it sort of shows the effects of it. So I do need to go and get that, but it's really annoying because I need to. I'm going to have to get someone to come with me, I think. Uh. Here, got this from a guy at Bravo Company. It cost me three crates of cigarettes and maybe the last porno mag on earth. But I figured I owed you for saving our asses back there. Wow, that's... thank you. Could have done without the mental image, but thank you. Hey, you stepped up for people you barely even knew. That means something. But officially, of course, uh, you're all still lawbreakers and squatters, and you'll be arrested as soon as we've got a jail. Of course. Yeah, I have, I have no, I have no idea what he's just giving. What is he just giving? What was? I don't even know what he just gave me. Moral issue, fear. Oh, that's because that guy's upset. Who the bloody hell am I looking for? Not him. I'm looking for her. Right, she's outside. Oh yeah, you can switch light with loads of different people now. Oh, which one was I? Oh, for fuck's sake. I think I was that one. Yeah, was. Uh, yeah, you can switch with loads of different people now. They, yeah, I think it's once you get to, to a certain um, like level of friendship, I suppose, you can actually switch with people. Oh, do you know what? I don't even know which way it is. Uh, she's there. There she is. Hello. How's it going? Uh, Move. That's right, yeah, she's just gonna follow me around now. So I'm gonna go and get some materials that I require to try and get this new home of mine. Um, because it's been really annoying me. I really wanna get it, but it's so, so it's, it really is a lot of effort. That guy is pissing me right off. Yeah, so that was another um, one of these special zombie people. Really annoying. Okay, right. So I've uh, a couple of things I've noticed. Um, things like cars, 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 cars. Really, really annoying. The reason I say that, um, because you they don't respawn like manually. They don't just appear so you have to look after your oh, for God's sake you have to look after your cars guys because if you do not look after your cars you will not have any left um, I don't really look after mine or maybe I should um, but there is also a fastest car in the game which I've uh, which I managed to find and then I blew it up uh, well I didn't intentionally blow it up um, I sort of like hit something and flipped it and then it blew up <laughs> Oh, for God's sake, will you leave me alone? Okay, so this is... Oh, for God's sake. Better look around, so. for 
Clear. Right, okay. So, I'll just quickly get this stuff. Um, yeah, so you can, like, expand. You can add outposts, which are meant to be safe areas, which give you more stuff. And loads of bloody yard of stuff. Uh -huh. um, really annoying because I, know, I need a lot of this stuff and it's really annoying. Uh, so you can carry it. And you, uh, you can also call for scavengers, establish an outpost. Um, death from above, which, oh yeah, um, toss the item to call an artillery strike. I don't know why you'd even need that. Um, and Maybe later. Oh, damn it, no one that anyway wants that one. Found some supplies. Sweet. Send runners for pickup. So basically what's going to happen now is some guy from your camp will come down and just pick up the items that you can't carry. Because I don't really want to break the stuff, because if you break it then you lose out on quite a bit of stuff. Uh, I will take them though. Nice. Sweet. Uh, so you'll probably see actually... Yeah, I could probably have took that. Um, that woman I was done with, uh, she could probably got it. But you can probably see right uh, there. Hey, it's running our base, what the fuck? I'm just going to kick his ass. Yeah, when you do carry a big bag like this, you do use a hell of a lot of stamina, so just keep that in mind when you're running around How's with a bag on. Lots of Zeds right behind me. What the f... Ah, we're good, we're good. Mm. Jump over this, use all, more of my stamina. Uh, so you, there you go, you got... Oh no, is that her following me? Someone will go out and pick that stuff up. That was, uh... Oh no, yeah, she has. If you can see just here, there, look, see? So she'll go around and scavenge for it. Um, but they can get caught out and stuff like that. She shouldn't do there that close. Go. But I never gave you uh, she could do. probably could do with that. Uh, yeah, so we've got loads of different items now as well, which is really good. Um, some of them are better than others, and obviously the more expensive ones cost a bit more money, uh, or a bit more influence points, as it's called. I'll take the wackens. Take a sword. Right, I'm just going to do this, so um, this is to get rid of them, or get the morale back up to the um, maximum, hopefully. It shouldn't be a problem. Yo, yo, yo. Come with me. So basically, you, get out of your own head for a while. you just go around and kill zombies. Pretty easy. Um, so you just follow to where you need to go. Uh, also found that if you uh, you have stuff like okay? cars and things like that, you if you park them here, they do repair over Some time. You just need to um, you know, be like build it up and stuff. But, just um, the same yeah, there seems to be a lot of zombies around my base. Isn't, that shouldn't be happening. Really annoying. But I'm going to go down to the new area in a minute. Um, I'm gonna, I need to really establish this house, but it's okay. Now we're gonna kill some zombies the old-fashioned way. It's, it's been quite annoying to try and go oh, for god's sake there would have to be a fucking lord coming as well <coughs> if that horde catches us we're gonna, we're gonna be in some trouble Um, so I've noticed you just com if you combo them guys, you see the best way to do it. Wait till they're not down, um, and you should just be able to. Oh, for God's sake! You should just be able to combo most of them. Oh, is that it? No. I really hope that horde didn't see us. Cannot I cannot be bothered with trying to kill them all. Um, There he is. I knew there was someone here. Okay, oh. Um, yeah, so you you can click get collectibles and you can also speed it up by pressing the uh, LB button. But the problem about doing that is it makes a hell of a lot of noise. Oh, for fuck's sake, don't make noise. I'll show you what I mean. Nice work. And you'll see what, and you'll see what happens when um, it makes noise. Yeah, for our plan, worth taking, I suppose. Right, return home. So simple missions like that um, can be a little bit annoying um, because it's just, oh, for God's sake, give me up, will you? Look, I, I don't know what 
we're doing out here, but don't you think we should get back? We're about done. Thank you, by the way. I couldn't have done this without you. Bullshit. I mean it. We gotta stick together, right? Alone, I would have been vulnerable. We need people to watch our backs. Perfect. Perfect power slide. Right, so I'm gonna show you. Oh, for God's sake. Look, I'm gonna show you um, really, the really new place I'm gonna go to. Good. Right, so that should be that mission done. It should put the morale near enough to top, I think. Uh, just to get rid of the fear factor. I think it does, is it? New, oh, brilliant, so it didn't do fuck all. What a waste of time. Right, so I'm going to go to this point here. I'm going to do the, one of the main missions, because I haven't met her yet. Um, there is all these little side missions, help kill the big ones and stuff like that, but I really can't be asked. Uh, so you can't get to this place yet. The bridge is blocked off. So you can go this way. Um, and this is the person I'm going to talk to. It's a cop. But, you know. Um, right. Should I take someone with me? Yeah, I'll take someone with me. Actually, she might be outside. And she might be outside. The reason I take the same person is because she knows what she's doing. And I know Why she's got. Shut up. So I'm just going to do a mission in. So normally when she chats shit, she, you normally get missions in, which is really annoying sometimes because it just means more stuff you got to do if you. Oh, for fuck's sake, where is she? Um, it just means more stuff you got to do when sometimes you just don't want to do it. Where is she? Is that her? No, where the fuck? Oh, she's on a mission. What the fucking, what the fucking mission is she on? Oh, brilliant. Yeah, so I don't even know what mission she's on. So they just go and do their own random shit. So I think they just go and like, find stores and things. Oh my god, I'm so close. I need 40 ma um, materials to finish off the, um, the building I'm doing. I could go and look at these buildings and see if there's stuff in them. Because that's where you normally find the materials that you need. But for this, I'll just do the, mis the actual mission itself and uh, I'll show you guys what it's all about. So, this, this hasn't been going on for 12 minutes and it's just been me absolutely fucking about, really doing nothing, <laughs> not too much. So, a moment. Oh, for fuck's sake, see what I mean? Like, this, oh, for fuck's sake. These bullshit missions, and it's just like, oh, I need someone to talk to because I'm a little fat. Just please just leave me alone. So, that does happen quite a lot through the game, so you do have to get used to it. Um, but you know, it's something you gotta deal with. Nice. Let's get that one. The only reason I'm getting this guy is because it's faster. Uh, you'll learn which of the faster cars. If I can find the faster ones, I will show you which ones they are. But this one's is whoop. One, it's noisy, it makes a massive um, area. And two, uh, it's very, very slidy. There's a horde. There's a super fucking zombie. But I'm out of here. That that car there next to me is probably one of the fastest cars in it. Oh shit! Yeah, I'll get it. I'll show you what I mean. Not, oh damn it! Hey, do you do you think you could do me a favor while you're out there? I'm on it. No, never mind. It's stupid. Wait, what? I've been packing up my dad's stuff, and I found a watch box. It's from the birthday present I got him when I was twelve. I recommend. So, I will recommend, guys, that you do constantly change your car to the cars that are full health. Because if you don't, you'll end up just blowing your car up. Because you do change a hell of a lot. Like, you do um, destroy them very, very quickly. Um, right, so obviously, I've been down here some, a little bit. You can, like, pretty much, well, within reason, pick quite a lot of places. I'm thinking about going into a. Um, oh, for fuck's sake. Like, this is what destroys your car. Look at that, look how much damage that did to me. Oh shit, and it also made me a frame rate like brilliant. Please sort yourself out. I'll pause it. And it might sort itself. Oh shit. 
nyomp. Oh, Mr. Turning, for God's sake. That's also annoying. That map needs to zoom out a bit. Stupid zombies have ruined it. Yeah, I've loaded the horde, which, are about, which consists of about five people now. Five zombies, so well done. I do need to try and find that the fastest car in it, or the best car in it. It's a, um, it's a Mustang, I believe. Oh, oh, shut up. I don't know why I didn't just ping it. Probably help. This should be interesting. All due respect, Your Honor, we're stretched too thin as it is. You got half my guys guarding the dispensary instead of out there pushing these things back. I understand the difficulty, Sheriff, but I don't know what you expect me to do about it. We only have so many trained officers left, and I'm not comfortable with the prospect of arming civilians for this kind of work. If you'd let me start training them, I... We'll discuss this later, Sheriff. We have a visitor. Oh, hello, visitor. Welcome. I suppose you've heard our broadcasts? Well, it's all true. We have a safe, secure society here, governed by the rule of law. Walk with me. I'll explain. And you can also you go and fuck society? yourself. I'm sorry. What exactly happened to the United States while I wasn't looking? Look around. We're facing a disaster of unprecedented scale. We have no way of knowing how widespread it is or how long it will take federal authorities to respond. Until they do, we have to look out for ourselves. It may not be the most constitutionally traditional succession, but it's all we have. All we have. The army's camped just across the river. Yes, and other than vaguely threatening radio broadcasts, they've made no attempt to contact us or provide relief efforts to the civilian government. Meanwhile, ordinary citizens like yourselves are living in fear. Fear of the dead. Fear of the criminal element that sees this as an opportunity to prey on their fellow man. Fear of the uncertain future of our nation. But it doesn't have to be that way. And, of course, all firearms will be surrendered. Only duly appointed law enforcement officers are allowed to go armed. Right. Well, thanks for the offer. But we're doing just fine on our own. And I'm damn sure not surrendering my weapon when the streets are full of flesh eating dead people. I'm very sorry to hear that. We'd certainly prefer it if people joined us freely before the issue has to be forced. Is that a threat? Just a reminder that the Wild West doesn't last forever. Don't take it personal. He's under a lot of strain. We're penned in pretty good by these things, and like you might have heard, we're short-handed. Tell you what, help me clear some of these problem areas out, and I'll vouch for you. Put in a good word, maybe set up some kind of trade arrangement. We've still got some stuff to take care of out there. Feel like lending the hand? That Come sounds like a good idea. Hope you're geared up. We've got a few infestations to deal with. Fuck. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm not geared up for this. Oh, maybe I'm, who the fuck is this? Hey, well, isn't that, I don't know. Where are we going? Where are we going? Oh, that, okay, I see. Uh, so it's just the one at the minute. Shouldn't be too hard, I don't think. Looks like I've got the, the boss for it. That's good. I think I did see, um, where'd it go? Where the fuck? Yes, supply it off there, which... Has nothing but medical supplies in. Which is now more mine, yeah. <laughs> right, okay, so the video is getting on about 20 minutes, so I'm gonna stop the video here. Um, and obviously, you can look forward to me kicking some zombie butt. Thanks for watching, guys, and I hope you enjoyed this state of um, decay. I almost forgot what it's called again. And uh, yeah, and you can watch me kick some ass. See you later. <laughs> Undead Labs advertising themselves. Good effort.